Welcome to Hudson County TV. I'm Fernando Uribe, reporting from Union City, as I bring an exclusive one-on-one -on -one interview with Union City Mayor and 33rd District State Senator, Brian Stack. How important seeing four years later after Governor Christie, then candidate Christie was campaigning here, coming back to Union City? I, I think it's great that Governor Christie comes back. Not only Union City, but Fernando, he shows his commitments to the urban areas. This is a governor of all the people of New Jersey. It's unprecedented. I've never seen anything like this in my life. Um, the governor's been terrific to Union City. He's been great to the urban areas. He doesn't shy away from any area in New Jersey. And it shows you that's a governor of all the people. There's no doubt about that. A mayor, four years ago, you rolled a lot of dice politically. I know you took a lot of heat from fellow uh, legislators and, and politicians here in Hudson County about the governor visiting. Four years later, seeing all the support for Union City now, how relieved are you and also how pleased are you with all the support he's giving you? It's great. Um, we got to work hard for Governor Christie, there's no doubt. We're going to treat it as if I was on the ballot, which I am on the ballot as the Senate, but we're going to work hard for the governor. The governor deserves that support. It's not about politics. It's about what he's done for Union City, what he's done for the state of New Jersey. This is a governor who's made tough decisions and really has worked for the people. It's not about himself. It's about the people. He could have made some, some other decisions that might have been a little more popular, but he chose to really go out there and do what's right for the state. And it's very hard to find that. Very hard to find a governor who's up front and honest and tell people exactly what's on his mind and what the state needs. Maybe sometimes unpopular medicine, but you know what, in the long run, New Jersey will be better for it. Mayor, fellow legislator in the state Senate, Barbara Bono, candidate against Governor Christie, has, has had some very unpleasant things to say about you. It's politics, but What's the message you can give to candidate Bono right now, considering that you've endorsed Governor Christie? I mean, look, I'm focused on supporting Governor Christie. Uh, whatever his opponent does or says in this election really doesn't matter to me. It's about who's been there for the people of not only Union City, the 33rd Legislative District. You pick up the phone, we do a lot of constituent outreach, myself, my staff. You pick up the phone and you reach out for them any time. A cabinet member will call you back. I have constituents that reach out on their own to this administration, unprecedented. There's a response back from the state immediately, and that's the type of action we need. This is about people helping people. The governor has been there for the people of the 33rd, been there for the people of Hudson County, whether Democrats like it or not. He's been there and he's been a governor of all the people, and I think we should recognize that. I think the bigger people in this whole picture put aside party affiliation and say, you know what, let's support the person who's doing the most for the general public. Mayor, once you win re-election this November as state senator, what areas do you feel need the most uh, addressing in the new year once you take term again? Sure. I mean, it's, there's a various issues. Obviously, property tax relief is something we got to really work on. It's a never-ending problem. Uh, obviously, education. Um, there's so many different issues that you could focus on. But you know what? It all comes down to the issues of everyday people. What the people bring to my office, what the people come to me on, is what I work extremely hard on to resolve. Well, once again, Senator, we appreciate a couple minutes and a uh, great party tonight. And again, great getting the governor to come out to Union City. Listen, we're grateful that the governor came here again tonight. And he's always welcome in Union City. And he's, he's been and truly a friend to uh, the people of the state. All right, thank you. Thank you, Senator. Thank you very much. Thank you so much for watching. For more programming and exclusive one on one interviews, such as the one you saw today, please go to HudsonCountyTV.com. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Twitter. And as always, stay classy, everyone.